Welcome to Hand Tool Reviews. Today we're reviewing the Wera BitSafe 61 by Torsion set. This is a 61 piece set. It has 61 pieces inside and that does include the bit holder. So the case itself is made in China. Wera does manufacture these textile cases now in China. So this is the packaging from one of these textile boxes themselves. As you can see, it says made in Volkswrap China. So these are made in China now. Here's a part number for one of these empty textile boxes. Bit safe, you can fit up to about 61 pieces in there and they usually come with one piece. But these cases are now made in China. They used to be made in Taiwan and elsewhere, but they're now made in China. Let's take a look at the textile case itself. It's very heavy duty and durable as well. It does have Velcro on the back. So if you want to, you can attach it to some kind of Velcro strip. Where it does give you these kind of Velcro strips as well. And you can attach them to anything and you can clearly see this is the velcro on the back so you just stick it on like this just goes on easy that way let's open up this case and let's take a look and let's see what's inside as well so opening up the case inside we have 60 bits and one bit holder it could technically fit another bit holder as well that's why there's an empty spot and there's 60 bits and one bit holder as i mentioned the bits are held in via some kind of harder plastic but it is a little bit easy to get some of the bits in and out this is the bit safe 61 by torsion one set you have the code number and then you have the barcode number as well and you can see it comes with phillips one two phillips two one phillips three comes with two phillips one eight phillips two one Phillips three, one pause drive one, two pause drive two, one pause drive three, comes with two pause drive one, eight pause drive two, one pause drive three, and then moving on torques, these are regular torques, three torques ten, two torques fifteen, four torques twenty, four torques twenty-five, two torques thirty, and one torques forty. And then we have slotted, these are all five point five, zero point eight, one point oh. 1.2 but those are all essentially 5.5 though and you have the hex plus so you have three 2.5 three 3.0 three 4.0 and two 5.0 something to also note is on the slotted you can see for example it says bdc those are diamond coded whereas btz are their torsion zone and you can tell which ones are which for example so the ones that have a golden color those are the diamond coated and they might have a titanium nitrite coating as well which is like a tin coating and the ones that are just gray for example these are the torsion zones so let me show you these are the torsion zones so they can be used in impact applications and here's one of the diamond coated bits as well you can see something to also note while the case is made in china the bits themselves are made in the czech republic same with the bit holder itself so it comes with a small wear a rapid adapter these are thick as well so they may not reach in the tightest of places as well so it has ball bearings which hold the bit in and there's a magnet as well to use it all you have to do is just push it up it unlocks insert your bit push it down so even if you don't push it up you can just simply insert your bit and it will lock in place as well. And then to simply remove it, push it up, and then you can remove your bit. Now let's see if it has any effect on picking up screws or any other bits. So as you can see, it does have a somewhat weak hold, but it can pick up other screws or bits. But this collar probably has something to do with the magnetism. And this Wera rapid adapter, as they call it, you can put in some kind of a drill or any kind of chuck. It's a standard one four inch. These bits are all one four inch. They're C6 standard. They're 25 millimeters as well. The bits are somewhat easy to take in and out as well. It does require a little bit of force to take them out, but it seems to be easier to put them back in a little bit. So as I mentioned, the golden colored ones, except for these ones, that's just how they differentiate positive drive. They did the same thing sort of on their tool check plus as well. But the golden colored ones, those are the diamond coated ones generally. And the ones that are silver coated, those are the torsion zone. So you got a good selection of Phillips, positive drive, Torx, and hex as well. But there's no hex six. And if you want to, you can remove some of these bits and put your own as well. So if they do wear out, you can just put some of your own bits. And it does lock up pretty easily. So you just close it up and it has Velcro that holds it. You can even put two inch or three inch longer bits in here and it'll close up and it'll lock up. But it's recommended to do it on the sides as well. If you put them closer to here, it won't close properly. Just to show you the difference between the diamond coated bits and the actual bits that are just positive drive. So for example, this is the titanium nitrate coating on a positive drive one. And here's a positive drive one that has the typical kind of coating that they use to differentiate it. So this is diamond coated. So it has a titanium nitrate coating and has some kind of a diamond coating on the actual tips. 
and you can see it's from the same series but it says th and this one says dc so diamond coated and here's some Phillips ones as you can see they both have a similar torsion zone profile but one of them is diamond coated the one that says DC is diamond coated so that's this one also has a titanium nitrate coating and this is the regular bi torsion zone as well so that's using their their standard whatever alloy they're using this one's a titanium nitrate coating and it has a diamond coating as well and this one is just the regular torsion zone both of these can be used in impact applications and you can see the difference as well it's hard to show the diamond coating but it does wear off as well you can see you can see the diamond coating a little bit it does wear down and it almost becomes sort of gray and here's the Phillips 3 you can possibly see the diamond coating on this much better it's a very fine diamond coating and this is titanium nitrate as well it's a tin coating Phillips 3 BDC as well so bit torsion diamond coated so let's get to a summary and conclusion on this do I think it's a good set I do think it's a good set would I recommend it probably not unless you get this for a really cheap deal I've seen the prices on these and they're much more expensive than the typical regular wear sets. The only advantage this set has over some of their other bit safe is that this textile case or the set is really good. It's much better than the other one which is which can drop bits easily. With this one, if you shake it, nothing's gonna come out. And you have a spot where you can actually put an extra bit in there. So you can put an extra maybe two inch bit or you can put another bit holder or whatever in there. So that I consider that a pro. As for cons, I'd say I don't like this wrap adapter. It's too bulky. It's too thick. There's no hex six in here overall i'm not too pleased or happy with this the case is good and the bit selection is good they could have done this better they could include some hex six they could have included maybe some security torques and other things as well so that would have really made the set a lot better and they could have just maybe either st stuck with making it by torsion only or they could have just stuck with making a diamond coating and for the prices that i've seen that these go for i want to recommend picking it up at the regular price only if you get on sale maybe i'd recommend them but i'm not a fan of this rapid adapter either it's compared to just regular magnetic adapters from philo or weha or even from wera this is not so great and it's too bulky and it's too small otherwise the bit selection is okay but the mismatch in aesthetics is not that great and the price on this is not great as well so would i recommend it yes but on one condition only if you get it on a really good sale and even then you should maybe look for other kind of alternatives such as maybe just buying the case alone and putting your own bits in that set otherwise i wouldn't recommend it for the regular retail price because this is much more expensive compared to their other textile cases or sets or even the regular plastic bit safe so if you found this video helpful please be sure to like and subscribe and feel free to leave a comment down below thank you